<clears throat> Hello, my Wolfpack puppies. We have just finished the very first mission with the foresters, and that quest was actually a bit longer than I had expected. So, before we continue the second part, I am going to go back and do some other side quests. So, let's go back to Steve's farm and head on over to Moorland. Ooh, it's really foggy. Okay, and it looks like more land's down this way. Maybe if I do this, then I'll be able to see where to go. Go. That beam of light's gonna help us. Hmm, I wonder why it's so foggy. Maybe it's a part of the story or quest? Let's talk to Stacy. <clears throat> oh, hi! Are you a friend of the Bobcats? I could really use a hand. My name is Stacy, and I just moved to Moorland. Since I used to be in a riding club with Loretta's cousin, Eliza, she and Tan invited me to join the Bobcats. I'm so lucky to have a new club to train with, but if I'm honest, the training regimen here is a bit lacking. The cross country tracks are great. But a truly exceptional club requires discipline. We need a proper schedule and routines to help horse and rider prepare for any com competition formats they might encounter. Loretta has agreed to let me host Cavaletti and show jumping classes here in the paddock. And that's how we become our best, by lifting each other up. With practice, the Bobcats will be stronger competitors than ever. And since you aren't a Bobcat jacket, that means you're one of us too. I'd love to train you. But first, I need more cones to set up the course. Have you seen any around? When you find them, bring them here so we can start my very first class. Cones. Okay, it's kind of hard to see with how foggy it is, but I'm sure we'll be able to find them. You picked up a cone. You picked up a cone. You picked up another cone. Thank you. There should be plenty of cones to work with. Now, this is a very simple exercise, and I just want to see how you handle it, as I've never seen you ride before. Have a go, and we'll see if you're ready to enter more advanced training sessions. Okay. Looks like I'm leveling up Noble Singer. Ooh, new music. This track is actually super easy. I'm sure beginners can play this as well. Mm. Nice! There really was no reason for me to worry. You did great! If you want to enter another class, you're more than welcome. Mm. I'd like to help you train on a more challenging show jumping course, but there's a bit of a situation. When I was setting up obstacles for my next training lesson, I ran out of pink poles from the club supplies. Fortunately, Jenna at the stables was happy to lend me the poles I need. The only trouble is they're green. Apparently, this shade of green is used by the club's arch rivals, the Bulldogs. We can't have that. Per Loretta, Bobcats wear pink and use pink and not only on Wednesdays. I guess we're painting the poles pink then? Grab a paintbrush. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can start your lesson. We're painting the poles pink. Okay. Can I be my horse for this? Or... No, I have to dismount. Okay. Careful, noble singer. Hopefully you don't get painted. The 
Holes are now perfect bobcat pink. Now that Loretta won't object, I can set up the course. The paint is still wet, so you have to help Noble Singer clear the jumps. Unless you want their coat to match the... The... Something colors. Are you ready for your second lesson? This course is a bit more complex than the last one, but it's still very basic. Of course, even experienced riders need to go back to the basics every now and then. Did you know that the top show jumping riders in the world rarely practice on obstacles as tall as they use in competitions? Using shorter obstacles like cavaletti and cross rails puts less strain on your horse, reducing the chance of injury and letting you both train longer. Go ahead and give this course a try, Holly. You got this. Here we go. Oh, can I collect that? Oh, shit. What? I think I left the area of the wildwoods a lot longer. Uh, longer ago. Oh, wow, that was really quick and easy. We're solid on the approach. Good posture. Yes, I think you'll be ready to test your skills on a competition level show jumping course soon. Man, these are a lot of new quests. You've really excelled at our training session so far. If you and Noble Singer think you're ready, I'd like to invite you to try something a bit trickier. A proper show jumping course like you might encounter at a competition. Are you ready? Then let's begin. Yep. That's okay. Whoa, is the floor broken? Oh, that's the finish line. You didn't see that. You and Noble Singer handled yourselves like seasoned show jumpers. If you want to practice on this course again, I'm offering training sessions every Monday through Thursday. I'm looking into hosting more difficult training sessions during the weekends. Compared to what you'll come across in the competition world, this course is still pretty basic. If you want to take your skills to the next level, you'll have to travel elsewhere in Jorvik. I hear that the riding arena near Silver Glade has some especially challenging courses. Of course, I hope you'll keep training here with the Bobcats. You've been my favorite student. Don't tell her I said so, but Loretta could learn a thing or two from you and Noble Singer. Yay, we did it! Right on, right on.